Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to take a look at uTorrent and why it's possibly the worst program on the internet. As you can see, we've removed our download links, which are normally here, and we're going to show you why you want to avoid this thing like the plague. You can see it's a five-star rating because it's been here for so long. It was rated so high when it was completely free that we can't even get the, the rating back down to the one that it deserves. We actually had a new license category for it. We'd like to call it embarrassing. Let's take a look at why, and let's give you some alternatives. Check the video description later. There's the classic uTorrent, Qubit Torrent, and if you list by, where is it, popularity, you can kind of look through and see what other people like, and we'll provide a couple links and suggestions for you in the video. Wait till you see this. Here we go. First thing that's going to happen is you're going to get an error, and Windows Defender is going to block it. There you go. We're going to allow it. And we're going to try it again. So here's what's going to happen. It's going to try and install two browsers. Not one, but two. And we don't mind if people do that. We just mark the program and then we highlight it in red so you know to watch out for it or to completely avoid it. In this case, it's a no-brainer. I personally like this next one, by the way. Beware of online scams. Yeah. Yeah. We're in the biggest online scam going right now. Joke. Opera Web Browser. Uncheck it. Avast. Hilarious. Whoop. See what happened? That's how it happens right there. It clicked too quick. Decline. Now check this out. Now that I hit accept, it won't let me go back. There we go. Let's try it again. There we go. Another little sneaky thing I hadn't noticed first time around. Big surprise. All right, let's get it installed. Let's launch it. Here comes bloatware, malware. Bundleware, scamware, scumware. Load it up. So we're going to get an ad over here. We're going to get an ad over here. You can upgrade to Pro, but I wouldn't trust them. I wouldn't give them a dollar. I wouldn't give them a penny. Let's see what else we got here. D Live. Don't know what it is. Don't care. Oh, yeah, by the way, in a few minutes, a malware page is going to pop up. Mm hmm. See, they open a new page. Here's another one. Ready for this? Did you notice anything else? Let me close this out. Unbelievable. Look at this. I went and installed it without my permission. It's Adaware. Nobody's used Adaware in 15 years. That's an embarrassment. It just gets worse and worse. So now I got this. <clears throat> watching my language for YouTube. Close it. Quit. Yeah. Exit for good. Ooh, cookies. That's, that's, that's the least of our problems. Of course, now it won't move. There we go. Don't know what Tron TV is. Don't care. Then here's your upgrade to Pro. Is if you hadn't had enough upselling, they're going to try and throw you in a virtual private networking, which actually some of the best VPNs are paid for. But as you can see, Add free, pro, joke. And the ads are changing. They're changing down here. Videos, it's you, get, you probably can't see, but it's, it's chunky and it's slow and it's bloated. And it's just embarrassing. It's just embarrassing. So there you go. Avoid uTorrent like the plague. It's just even if you opt out of the browsers, they're still going to hit you with adware if you click anything else. It's ridiculous. Drive-by download should not exist in this day and age. And check our video description for a better option. Thanks for watching. As always, see ya.